and it's the end of the series and we're here at Christchurch. Now New Zealand dominated both test matches. They definitely dominated this one as well. Now India dominated the T20s, but New Zealand took over those ODIs and they made sure they took away the 120 points for the series for winning it. There are some important takeaways that kind of come from this performance. Yes, India has been in form. They've won all the matches so far in the Test Championship until they got here as this away series here in New Zealand. Um, the captain, Virat Kohli himself, has said, you know, it's a collective effort. It's obviously difficult. Winning away matches is definitely very difficult when it comes to Test cricket. And especially coming to New Zealand and you look at the past history, it's been very difficult for many sides to come here and be dominating. It's definitely an advantage that the home side definitely has. There's many takeaways from these two test matches for both sides. Now for the Indian fans, make sure you aren't disappointed. I think there's a lot of positives that came from the matches. It's always very difficult to win in an away series. For the Indian players, the bowlers have been able to adapt. You were able to see kind of that the bowlers were able to adapt to the conditions. It was just the batting was a little troublesome, but I'm sure the Indian team will get there. For the New Zealand side, they found their man, Kyle Jamison. And I'm sure he, there's only a moment away until he makes his T20 debut. And also the way Trent Bolt and Tim Southey have performed. Tim Southey has 14 wickets under his name from the whole series. And he was the player of the series while Kyle Jamieson was the man of the match for the Christchurch match. So clearly a lot of great performance, a lot of amazing cricket being played.